Peter has bought me a squirrel. I'm very excited. Well, what I would suggest you do, um, it's very fresh, is that we gut it and then we skin it and prepare it in the way that a, that a butcher would so that you have a, a perfectly clean carcass to cook as you wish. Can you show me how? Yeah, of course. So what we've done is open the abdomen and there you can see all the normal... It looks very clean, doesn't it? The kidneys, you've got the kidneys, so you might like to keep those separate. Mm. Can I eat the liver as well? Yeah, I'm sure you could. I can't see it's going to be any different from any mammal liver. I've never eaten kidney liver. So there it is. That, 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 that was gutted. That? Yeah. Gosh. There you are. You're going to get quite a nice chunky leg from that. I mean, if I'm being honest, they're a poor return on investment from the point of view of the time and energy that you put into preparing it. But they are delicious. So Peter has skinned and jointed the squirrel beautifully for me. I'm just going to season these. And some pepper. And I'm going to brown them in some hot oil. But those are looking lovely. Into the bowl. And I want that to boil for a minute or two before I add my meat. Three juniper berries. And I'm just going to put my squirrel back in, turn down the heat. And that is going to braise with a little bit of thyme for about an hour. Just got some beetroot leaves here. People think that beetroot is just about the ball-shaped bit at the bottom, but in fact, the leaves are delicious as well. And I'm just going to put a handful of these into my casserole and just let them wilt down a little bit. It's beautiful. It smells amazing, doesn't it? Oh, look at the colour, look at that. How is it? It's perfect. It really is, lovely. Good. It's really nice, thank you very much indeed. Thank N you for... Nutkin will be proud of you. Thank you for bringing the squirrel, Peter. Pleasure was mine, not his.